take the decision to cease my playing career with the uh, Kangaroos. It was the scandal that rocked a club, shut the football world, and dethroned the king of the game. More than a year ago, an abusive trust ruptured the Kangaroos, but the strength of mateship held them together. Tonight, a man once revered will face those he betrayed. And while time heals all wounds, in this case, the scars are still raw. I think that uh, just over this ladder, if he's there to be cleaned up, I'm sure. I'm really excited. Well, yeah, look, I definitely want to beat. A lot of people are coming to the game. I don't know, expecting a bit of a fracker. Hopefully it does happen. Here's for you, never know. This is the one we've been waiting for. The Kangaroos and Adelaide at Telstra Dome. This is Nine's Friday Night Football. As you can see, walking into the Adelaide rooms, no time to talk to the media, very focused on proceedings, and Wayne Carey gets his moment of truth tonight, because as we heard in the intro there, the North Melbourne boys, well, when they come out to play, they are looking for number two of the Adelaide Crows, just like everybody else here today, and there he is, Gary Lyon, what a big game performer this man has always been throughout his career, and probably, personally, no bigger game than tonight. You're absolutely right, Eddie. Good evening. It is intriguing. It is a man that loves centre stage for different reasons tonight, but I get a feeling that he will thrive under this pressure. He's up against a side who are also renowned for their fighting spirit and their, their willingness to band together for a cause. They'll be right behind their captain, Anthony Stevens. It's, got to, it's an intriguing contest. That man, uh, Clint Archer, and his mate, Anthony Stevens. Two of the closest footy players going around. Two players in a massive drama last year. And here come the kangaroos, and that man. And Anthony Stevens became the captain of the club because of the circumstances last year. Celebrated and well documented circumstances where his mate and captain Wayne Carey had an affair with his wife, split the club, but the kangaroos were able to come back together because of the closeness of Glenn Archer and Anthony Stevens and the senior players around him. Hearts to hearts, hands to hands, the kangaroos. There they are, they're ready to go tonight. It is going to be a fantastic tussle, and let there be no mistake, this hasn't been hyped beyond expectation. This isn't a Don King production, Gary. No. This is an absolute battle between the team where hearts were broken.